Hello guys, in the previous video, I showed you how you can install this depth anything on Ubuntu system locally. I have also gone into great detail in that video, which you can check on my channel here, where I explain in great detail as what exactly this depth anything is. And I will also drop the link in video's description. Now, just to give you a quick recap, this depth anything is released by TikTok. And this depth anything deals with depth estimation from your images. So it is primarily just like teaching a computer to understand how far away objects are in a photo. Just like human beings can guess how far things are by just looking at them in any picture. So this is what this depth anything does. I'm not going to go into the technical details of this depth anything in this video because I already have gone through it in that video. So let's not uh, repeat it. But in simpler terms, depth anything is just like giving the computer a superpower to judge distances in photos. And they have also got this GitHub repo where they go into more detail about this monocular depth estimation, how to um, do this, what are the features and all that stuff. and you can uh, find the link to it in video description too. Okay, now that's being said and done. Let me take you to my Ubuntu system where I am going to show you that how to do it. I have already installed depth anything. And of course, as I said earlier, you can check my previous video as how to do it step by step. Very easy. I'm using Ubuntu 22.04. The purpose of this video is to show you that you can also run this depth anything in GUI because in my previous video I was doing it in CLI but if you want to simply create a Gradio, uh, Gradio GUI then you can do that easily too. The command to do that is fairly simple and let me show you that command. Let me go there. So first make sure that you are in this path where your depth anything repo is then do ls and make sure that this app.py is there which is which we have and then simply run python3 app.py and then press enter and you will be running the gradio demo now you can run it locally or you can even run it on any public ip if you want to run it on a specific ip then you need to uh, do this let me actually show you what i have changed in order to run it on my public ip so simply um, vi editor open this file there and at the very last line i have just changed this server name 000.0 and server port 7860 you can give it any of choice of uh, ip of your choice and port 2 and if you are running it on any cloud instance then make sure that this port is open now let's run it so python3 app.py press enter and it is going to start the gradio on your local system so let's wait for it to start first time it takes a bit of a time let's wait for it to come back so that's it so you can see that it is already started here let me take you to my um, local system and then i will take you to my browser so this is a browser where it is running at the moment now let's upload an image and then see how it works let's click drop image here and i'm just going to select one of my own image or uh, maybe just from my repo so you can see that in this one there is a lady walking on the zebra crossing and there are some cars let's click on submit there you go and you can use the slider to slide it and so how correctly it has done the depth estimation here and you can also move it back if you like. Let's try it out with another um, image of our choice. You can just click on this upward arrow here on the left hand side. And then let me select another image of my own YouTube thumbnail. Let me click on submit. There you go. So it has correctly identified this fire thing and also my own silhouette here. Amazing stuff. Let me select one of their example. There you go. Click on submit. 
and let's wait for it to come back so it's a dark image but still it was able to make um, the still hood of this uh, building i think that's singapore and then also this thing and bit of these humps here amazing stuff let's check out this fish one let's click here and you can see that how cool is that it was able to recognize this fish this starfish and then also this another fish here and bit of a coral reef amazing stuff let me try out one more image from my own repo to see if it is able to make out of bit of people or not so i'm just going to give it a robot one let's see there you go so it was very very correctly it was able to get that robot here let's try out one last image i'm in sydney australia it's summer here and it's scorching today it's 40 degree and it's a beach day so let me select one of the beach images and see how it goes and it is able to detect uh, did, you know detect the people with the depth so let me run it and see how it goes there you go so it was able to detect the people and then also the surfboard and this purse here amazing stuff really impressed by it and then um, if you look at this this is going to also detect all of these mushrooms i guess beautiful amazing stuff look at this attention to detail anyway i could go on and on the whole day really impressed by this um, project as this is one of the coolest project out there i can um, you know tell you for sure because there is another project called as instant id and this act as the processor for um, depth estimation for that project too all in all this depth anything has been trained on 1.5 million labeled images and 62 million plus unlabeled, unlabeled images jointly it also improves zero shot and in domain depth prediction and refines control net and transfers to se semantic segmentation that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it if you are struggling or stuck with anywhere let me know and for the full installation please also watch my other video on the same depth anything if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you are already subscribed please do me a favor and share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching and thanks for your support